Here are two methods to fix this issue of DirectX 12 not being supported on your system. First, we need to check if DirectX 12 is installed on our system. You can do that by opening up your start menu and searching DXDIAG. Run the program and check this DirectX version at the bottom. Now, if you have DirectX 11 mentioned here, we'll need to try two methods to get DirectX 12 installed and updated on our system. One more thing. Click on this display tab up here and check if your system has a dedicated graphics card. If you have integrated graphics, these next few fixes might not work for you, but it's worth trying. The best way to get DirectX 12 updates is by checking if your Windows version is up to date. You can check by searching and checking if any updates are available. Next, you need to check if your graphics drivers are up to date. For NVIDIA GPUs, you can check driver updates through the NVIDIA app. There was even a driver update specifically for Marvel Rivals. These updates would be able to fix most issues. Now let's try the final fix method. Open Steam or Epic Games wherever you've downloaded Marvel Rivals on. On Steam, click on this cogwheel and click on Properties. And then paste in the command from the description, which is dash DX11. On Epic Games, click on these three dots and click on Manage. And toggle on Launch Options. Then paste in the command here. Try running the game now. Please note that the game has had a lot of issues running on older graphic cards, and the devs basically confirmed the game doesn't work on integrated graphics. If these solutions didn't work, please leave a comment, and I'll try my best to help you out.